Residents in Imperial Beach speak with officials about the dangers of fentanyl and what needs to be done if someone they know accidentally overdoses. Fox 5 Sarah Allegre attended that event and she joins us live with the big takeaways. Sarah. Well, Kathleen, awareness, that was one of the key solutions brought up today here at Mar Vista High School, where several local leaders gathered today to discuss the ever-growing fentanyl crisis right here within our community. It's unfortunately one that's killed several teens here across San Diego County, including one teen here in Imperial Beach. He was a 17-year-old, a beloved local skater who died just about a year ago today. My son came into the room and said, Mom, I feel hopeless. I don't want to be here anymore. Almost a year after her son's death to a fentanyl overdose, Carmelita Trujillo is sharing his story along with a message in the South Bay. And an hour later, I heard his sister screaming. They found him in the room and it was too late. Marcelino Camarena was a skateboarder in the area who died by suicide through fentanyl overdose at the young age of 17 after a years long battle with depression. Because of the right of refusal here in San Diego, we could not force him to get the help that he needed and his problems just escalated and escalated and escalated. One year later inside Mar Vista High, Marcelina's old school, dozens met Tuesday night with hopes of using his story for prevention, awareness and solutions. And I'm going to do everything in my power to prevent that from happening in the future. Imperial Beach Mayor Paloma Aguirre along with San Diego County DA Summer Stefan all in attendance. According to countywide stats, overdose deaths of teens 17 and under double from 2020 to 2021. Prosecuted 503 dealers, including seven for a murder, because this really is selling a poison. It's different than any other drug. A reality Mar Vista High School principal Teresa Kramer is working to prevent on her school grounds. The more the parents know, the more likely it is that they're going to be able to save their kids' lives. Tuesday's gathering doing just that. Law enforcement agencies handing out reversal the drug Narcan, a lifesaver to the effects of this deadly poison that killed a beloved son. Never say that it can't happen. You know, always be aware, always be involved, always be diligent. Really good stories to keep in mind and take home with us this evening. Now, Narcan is easily accessible. You can get it at any local pharmacy without a prescription. You could also go to any San Diego County Public Health Center. Absolutely zero questions asked. Now, here at Fox 5, we do have resources for you listed on our website. That's fox5sandiego.com. Just click on that scene on tab. For now, that's the latest here in Imperial Beach. Sarah Allegre, Fox 5 News.